Hey everyone, Shaver1000 here. Hopefully the wind's not too bad. I got my mic on with the dead cat. So we're going to take a ride up here. We're going to go down to Potts Preserve. It's about six miles. Hopefully the camera's not... Um, bouncing around too bad running about 35 right now 37 oh cool but yeah we're going to go down here to Potts Preserve, take this thing off-road a little bit, and then we'll head back home. So it's kind of like the maiden voyage of this thing, so... put a different seat on here I didn't I didn't go buy one I had one on that bike out back and um, I kind of just kind of got it rigged up right now I got some water. Of course, I got my smokes with me. I'm not going to be gone long. Just thought I'd give the bike a try. Make sure it's going to run all right. Charged the battery last night. Took about four hours. But they tell you that when you first charge it or if it's clear dead, it'll take four to five hours to go completely full charge. So, so far I put nine miles on this. This is the first time I've had it off of our street, so. Again, sorry for the wind noise. You know, these mirrors, they actually work. I see a car behind me right now. And there he goes. I'm just kind of wanting to see what the battery will do because I know down here to Potts Preserve is six miles one way so that'll be 12 miles just going there and back I do want to take it on some of the trails and see how well it does I'm not gonna be jumping ramps or anything like that those days are done for me um, Seventh gear, it's just, uh, I'd like to see, a, you know, another couple gears. But I'm just going to go ahead and use throttle. All the way there and all the way back. Because this is like kind of a long stretch of road through here and it pedals so easy if I put it on 
pedal assist uh, three or four, it's about where I need to feel on the on the pedals, but I don't know, I'd like to see a little higher higher gear for pedal assist, like you know, 10 speed or something. But so far, I'm liking the bike, especially for the money. Also, on the display, on the display, underneath it, there's a little rubber plug you can pull out. It stays in, but you can pull it out and uh, plug your phone in and keep your phone charged. Or, like the camera, I can plug the camera into it if I want to, but the camera's full charge and I've got an extra battery with me. So... I should have set the trip back to zero, <laughs> but we started eight my at eight, and um, it's on eleven right now. So we've went about three miles. So we're about halfway there. Yeah, this was a long ride if you guys remember the when I went solo camping with the tractor yeah this was a long ride I'm kind of impressed it is it, it is pretty quiet I mean for a cheap for a cheap e-bike it is a it is a pretty quiet bike okay so we went 3.7 miles We're running 50 volts right now, currently. And it's been eight minutes. And 25 seconds. All right, so we just turned over to four miles, so. I still haven't, I haven't put monkeys together yet. It was getting kind of late last night and I was a little tired, so. And she's working on, um, she's working on her, uh, on her videos right now, so. I thought I'd come down here. I was going to go on the bike trail, but I'm kind of saving that to ride some of that bike trail with her. I do have to say though this old this seat I had on that old bike around back is a lot better. Yeah, and I'm not sure how bad the wind is, but if it is, if it's bad, I'll just do a voiceover. I forgot my sunglasses. That kind of sucks. Now my eyes are watering a little bit. Right up here to the right. We'll pull down in here. 
it's where we was going to camp out one night, but, um, the water started rising for some reason, which is real weird in here, but they get, we had a lot of rain here, and also down in Tampa area, which really puts the water up here. That's the only thing I can, I haven't seen it that high since. We'll go down in here. Oh, this is some soft sand. And then we, we boated back in here. We brought the boat here one day. Yeah, see, it was up over here. And the water was behind the truck. We had the truck sitting here. And the water was up over here. So, yeah, that's pretty weird. Cool. Let's head out. Let's see how well it does going up this hill here. I'm pedaling it. Not a problem. A little rough. Sorry, guys. I just have my camera. I've got it on a mount. But um, I just have it zip tied onto the handlebar, so until I can get a regular bike mount for it. But see, like right now, on a regular bike, I wouldn't have been able to ride this. There's no way. I'd be out of breath. Well, I'm not supposed to be riding a bike. Anyway, they don't even want me walking through Walmart, like through the whole store, but I do. Because uh, I don't want to use those, those little buggies, you know, for in case someone that really needs it can have them, you know, so. But yeah, sometime maybe this summer, I'll do a, crap, <laughs> I'll do a, uh, do an overnighter on the bike trail or something, you know. There's a turtle. I don't know if you guys can see him. That's one of those tortoises. You can't, you can't touch them. They're, you're not even allowed to pick them up and take them off the roadway because you'll get in trouble. You can actually go to jail just, just for trying to pick them up and take them off the road. Um, off there to the left was uh, Oak Hammock where we go camping. Alright, we went six and a half miles, so this is a little farther. Than the original six I thought it was, so. But it depends on what part you're going to. So down here, we're going to be like right by the river. I'm not pedaling. I'm in. Uh, I'm on number five. We're running right at 34.9 and 35. And it's it's pretty accurate. I checked it with my phone last night on GPS. And other than like a couple points, it was it was pretty pretty much right on.
something else. Um, it does not have regen braking. I wish it did. Because, you know, like if you're coasting down a hill, it helps recharge your battery a little bit. Yeah, these mirrors are actually working out pretty good. We did go down a bar on the battery. How you doing, man? Fancy meeting you here. Yeah, I'm over here. Are you? <laughs> Take it easy, JD. Wow, that's cool. He's working over. He said he had to take a shit. Um, he's the guy that uh, I'm building the mini bike for. Yeah, we'll go up here and uh, I know it's probably a pretty boring video but this way if anyone anybody wants to see because there's another turtle there that one you can pick up and play with but um, a lot of guys they'll just they'll kick you on say okay we're gonna go up here and then when they get there they'll shut you off and then when they get there they'll kick you back on and at least this way you can see in real time what's going on, you know. We're on three right now, which is pedal assist or throttle. So this is where we camped at, right up here to the right. Well, there's a camper in there. That's where we camped out when we was trying our new tent out. Right there where, I don't know if you can see it, right there where that camper is. I just thought we'd run up through here. We'll, I'll, I'm going to go take a break up here on the river. And I'll kick you off, take a little break, get some water, and then I'll kick you back on and we'll go down. We'll go down the trail for a little bit. I'm not, I'm not going to go too far today. But I did want to get the bike out and try it out. in here where we usually go camping hopefully I can find a picnic table uh, uh, you can go sit at Yeah, there's a picnic table up here we can go sit at.
There we go. Right here in the shade. I don't like these brakes squeaking. Alright guys. I'm going to take a little break, get some water, and uh, I'll kick you back on, then we'll go over that way onto the trail. Okay, guys. Go up through here. Monkey and I walked this trail one time. Alright, I gotta fix my water bottle. my water bottle on here and I just kind of got it velcroed on and I have to get a saddle bag or something it might rattle a little bit but all right all right let's get down this trail Ice back in here. Yeah, this thing's all right off road. Very easy to handle. I think the shocks, the front shocks, it's like back over there, I felt a little thump. So. This comes out on a road up here, and I don't know what road it is. Sorry it's so bumpy, but... miles I got something biting me My camera's moving all around.
Yeah, we took a, a hike through here. We did a lunch thing and stuff, and I cooked lunch. Oops, sorry. That was a fun day. It was a couple mile hike. Yeah, I'm getting bit by these damn flies, man. These deer flies are biting the hell out of me. I gotta get out of here. But anyway, pretty much what I needed to know. Ow. Damn. Hate them stupid biting flies, man. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> I didn't think to bring my bug spray. Y'all uh, get me a regular handlebar mount for this camera and some sort of bag for the back. Thinking about buying a trailer. They got an enclosed trailer online for a hundred bucks. It's small, but I think it would fit my backpack. Whoops. Damn it. Yeah, once I get this thing straightened out, just a test run, so... We're looking at 19 miles right now. Overall, overall miles. Damn it. All right, we're back out here. Damn, bite and fly just got me on the hand. Man. That was a rough ride. Alright, checking my water jug and stuff.
I do like the bike though. We get out on the road. I'll just put some music. You guys can listen to music while we're riding back. That way you can see, you know, done the whole trip together. I took some pictures back there and sent the monkey. I don't know. Camera is very loose for some reason, will not tighten up. But like I said, you know, we'll get all that stuff later and really trick it out. Yes, yeah, so far this seat's not bad. It doesn't fit right, but it'll be good enough until I can find a good seat. Her mom said. Uh, a good seat is called post postman so might look into that let's see what's out there that stuff's not it's not real expensive it's pretty cheap so check check one two all right And here we are back at the gate. Let's go through here 35 and see if we can make it. Nah, I don't think so. Made it. Not at 35 though. Alright. So I'm going to put some music on for you guys right now and uh, try to enjoy the ride. <laughs> 